everybody, what's up? It's your main man, DJ Ronnie Mechanic here, back with another video. So, hey, look, before we begin, hey, make sure y'all hit that thumbs button, like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel, y'all. Hey, let's get this rolling, you know what I mean? So, uh, so yeah, I got a gem for y'all today. Look, while I was out of town, I'm always pretty much shopping you know me and the missus we always shopping and everything so while we was out uh i saw a thrift shop knowing me i love to go to thrift shops you know hey y'all find some pretty good things at those thrift shops so while we was there you know knowing me being an electronic guy i like to go in the electronic section just to see what the thrift stores have you know Sometimes you find good stuff, sometimes you don't. So in this case, I came across a nice set of speakers that I couldn't believe that was there. And I was just shocked, you know? I'm like, whoa, I'm like, these still here? I'm like, wait a minute. So if you wonder what I'm talking about, look y'all ain't gonna believe this but look i'm gonna show y'all the speakers that i found at the thrift shop y'all ready to see them look y'all see this y'all know what these are look 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 let's get a little close y'all see that name that's right bows that is right i found these at the thrift shop y'all and the crazy thing, guess how much I got them for? Anybody got a clue? Well, look, I'm gonna run the story down for you. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna show y'all the tag and I'm gonna tell you what happened. So when I saw them, I'm like, oh my gosh. I'm like, damn, they, they, these people got rid of these? So I seen the sticker price. Look, they got a sticker price right there. Y'all see it? What it say? Fifty dollars, right? They got on this one here. It say fifty. So, not reading the little lettering on the side of the uh, price. So I found one of the workers that worked there. And I say, excuse me. I say, uh, these bow speakers. I say, can you check the price for me? And the lady asked me. Uh, she said, bring one up. So I brought it. Brought one up. And I asked, I said, hey, are these 50 a piece or 50 for both? She said, oh, it's 50 for both of them. I said, what? I said, let me grab them. That's right, y'all. I got both of these here for $50. Look, y'all see that? What it say? $50 pair. That's right. I got both of these for $50. Hey, look, you tell me where you can find a set of bows in this good of shape for $50. Hey, I'll wait. And as you can tell, they not tore up or anything. Matter of fact, look, let me prop one up on the, uh, on my table right quick. Hold on, let me, let, let me set y'all down right quick. Look, I'm gonna sit y'all down right here. Oh, now this was a fan right here, boy. So, yes. Here we go, y'all. So, these right here, they are the Bose 501 series. These are the fifth series. So as you can see, uh, this one here is labeled for the right side. And the other one, you got the other one right here, is labeled for the left side. So, so the way that they're designed, they already got them pretty much uh, labeled for what position, you know, for your room. So I was like, wow, I was like, man, I came across a gym with these right here. I mean, just look at it. Look at the cabinet not tore up. 
If it's still in good shape. Y'all see that? This the back of it right here. You see it has one at two ports. Let's see, that's the information right here. Y'all see that? So these speakers here, they are six ohm rated. Uh, they take a power handling of 100 watts, but they say that they're compatible with amplifiers and receivers uh, between four and eight ohms from 10 to 200 watts a channel. So, yes. Look, you talk about a gem. And I looked up some information on these here, so come to find out, uh, each one of the cabinets come with a five and a quarter inch woofer on the inside, and both cabinets have uh, two tweeters right here. So let me, let me see, I can take this grill off. Let me pull it off. Woo. Yeah, you can tell it ain't, ain't been clean in a little bit. But look, those are the tweeters right there. You can tell they've been sitting, cause look, got the little dust on them. Uh, hold on, look, look. Let me get my little, my little brush right quick. Yeah. Brush these off. Give them a little brushing. I ain't gonna go. I ain't going too hard on them. Just a little brushing. That's about it, man. Wipe the dust off. Yes. All right. Looks pretty good there. So I think they said that these are like two. What is this? Two and a half, yeah. Two and a half inch tweeters. So you see they got them diagonally pointed, you know, like one position that way, that one out pointing forward. So you can tell they use like some type of little paper cone, whatever. I mean, it's still in good shape. You see the, the little middle cap not even pressed in or nothing like that. So whoever had them, they took care of them now. Here's the grill. As you can see, it's not tore up anything. Still in good shape. Yes. Well, you can definitely say I found a gem right here, y'all. I'm gonna put it back on now. Put it back in place. Boom, there we go. All right. There it is. I mean, that's a nice looking speaker too. I mean, come on, man. Y'all can't beat this $50 for a pair of bows. And look, not just any bows. I mean, look, these are the 501 Series 5s, man. I mean, come on. Y'all know bows, y'all know bows deal with sound quality. They got the two ports in the back, so. Now, they don't make these anymore here. They first, uh, matter of fact, they first uh, introduced these back in 1994. And the last time that they produced them was 2001 with the last year for these here. And man, when these things came out brand new, oh my gosh. Ooh, I think these speakers here was running somewhere in the neighborhood about, I think what, correct me if I'm wrong, I think like about $500, five or six hundred dollars, something like that. Brand new when it came first came out. Uh, like now, shoot, you could probably find some on eBay. Probably about shoot, I'm gonna say just to throw a number out, you maybe find a, a decent pair on eBay, probably for about a hundred fifty dollars, maybe less than that, or depending on the shape of them, you know. But hey, I got the best price of all though. Ooh, look at this. $50. Boy, you can't beat that. So now you know uh, 
I got to do a sound check. That's right. So I already have a set of wires already connected to my receiver. So this is my little garage receiver right here. This is what I use. Y'all see that? Got the Sony. And this right here is the, uh, the STR D915. And everything still works perfect. You see, I even got the old equalizer up there. I don't have it connected though. And right here, this is what I play the music on. This right here is a Sony 5 disc CD changer. But the difference with this one here, look, it plays USB. Yeah, and then look, I can even record on it. Yeah, buddy, step your game up, boy. What y'all know about that? So yeah, this is what I'm using to uh, power this boat. So it's pretty much right at the rated power for this. So yeah, I'm excited about this one. Let me go ahead and set y'all down real quick. I'll go ahead and plug this up. So of course I am not gonna play any copyright music. I'm gonna play my little my little music what I use for my intro. So that's that's about all we can uh, come across, y'all. So no copywriting. So so yeah. All right, got the wire hooked up. Y'all see that? Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and get this started. Man, this is cool though, man. I mean, t how many of y'all seen this though, man? That is if y'all still using the CD players, but still a CD player that has the USB input. Oh my goodness. Come on now. All right, so I got my little track playing. So let's see what it sounds like, y'all. a speaker this size not bad at all okay not bad at all all right so this is the right one hmm not bad so let me disconnect this one and let me hook up my my one on the left Hmm. Now I had this one on the ground right here. So 
So let's try this one out. Okay. Alrighty. I'm gonna take this one down. I'm gonna put this other one up. All right, so this right here is the, the left one right here. Matter of fact, let me take this. Let's see how dusty this one here is too. Let me see. Okay, you got a little dust on it. Not that bad. Let me go ahead and do a little light brushing. That's all. A little light brushing on it. Yeah, buddy. That is it. Let's see, it got a little air can. All right. Look, like I said, look at that. See that grill not tore up or nothing. Boy, whoever had these took care of them, I'll tell you that. And I appreciate them giving it away. I know I'm happy. All right. Let's try this from here, this left one, make sure it's working. Definitely say, I got me a steal on these here. Oh my goodness. Ain't nothing wrong with them. Boy, that's the best $50 I done spent yet. God dog it. Woo! Man. Ooh, these will go nice. Ooh, I could put these like in the room with a nice small little receiver on them. Oh my goodness. Hey y'all, I hit the jackpot with these. Mm -hmm. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? And look, I am not making this up. Y'all see that? Man, these things sound good. Man. 
I mean, this 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 small speaker thing is kind of new to me, though. You know, I'm so used to the, the to the big boys. You know what I mean? Yeah. And pretty much what I mean by I'm so used to the big boy speakers. Look, let me show you. I still have these bad boys right here. Let me let me show y'all. Look, 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 look. Y'all see what I'm working with? Them big Sherwin Vegas, man. I still got them. Yes. One thing I had to do to these, but I had to recon them. Well, pretty much like do the edge on them. That is it, y'all. And these are the the DX nines. I call them AKA the house rockers. Yes. So y'all see, yeah, I, I, lo I love my old school equipment right here, y'all. Yes. No doubt. But yes, I am totally happy with this here. Oh my goodness. I got me a nice set of speakers, y'all. For $50. Woo! Yes. So look. Hey, I just wanted to share my good find with y'all on this here. Hey. It just goes to show, boy, y'all can find some gems at a thrift shop. <laughs> if you don't believe, <laughs> look what I found. Yes. Show y'all one more time. That's them bowls, y'all. That's right. And just to let you know, I found those in South Carolina, y'all. Yes. So, yes, the out-of-town thrift shops have some gems. Tell you. Next time you go out of town, go to a thrift shop. You can bet your boy will be looking again, for sure. Yes. Man, oh, man. So now all I got to do now is just, uh, I'm going to wipe them down a little bit. Clean them up. They ain't that bad, though clean them up a little bit and yes i'm about to put these bad boys to use for sure so look i appreciate everybody checking out all the videos appreciate all my new subscribers and old subscribers thank y'all very much for rocking with me and for all the support hey we are now over the 2k mark yes that's right so i got to get together and uh do a little celebration for the 2k y'all yes we in this thing man Woo. i tell you right now there's a lot of hard work put into it but hey we did it man oh man i'm excited right here boy i got me a good set of bold speakers wow man oh man but yeah y'all hey i had to share this with y'all you know show y'all my happy findings that's what i see so look hey make sure y'all like comment share and subscribe Turn on that notification bell so that way you'll know whenever I drop a video, you will be notified. So, man, oh man. And uh, also, make sure y'all go check out Nancy B. The Scratcher. Check out her channel. And definitely, I got to give a big shout out to uh, my big bro and his wife. Uh, y'all make sure y'all go check out Chef Riz. That's right. The Chef Riz. 1291 go check him out and also check out his wife's channel anna marie xx love i will be highlighting everybody name in there and also y'all go check out my big sis sandra clark that's right aka boo bear check her channel out too y'all yes she do some good reviews on some cookies i know a lot of y'all like cookies out there yes that's right and and I just appreciate everybody from the top, you know. And definitely can't forget my boy Renrock. That's right. Check him out too. Renrock TV. Yes. Check him out. The littest channel in the morning on YouTube. That's right. We call it the Elevation Channel. Y'all make sure y'all check him out. That's right. Renrock TV. That's it. So, hey, y'all. I am through. So, I'm about to take these speakers down and clean them up and take them back inside so hey look i'll check y'all later and hey look on to the next video y'all yeah what i find it